Well, hello, fellow flight instructor. I'm John King. And I'm Martha King. After graduating Indiana University, Martha and John King dedicated themselves to being equal partners in everything they did. After a business false start, Martha and John decided to pursue a goal in something fun until a more serious opportunity came along. So they began by flying their own airplane to Western and Midwestern cities to provide weekend ground schools. After 10 years of teaching their two-day seminars, 50 weekends a year, they had taught their courses 500 times. By the time technology enabled them to put their courses on video, they had their jokes and their explanations refined. Because you could fall or your passenger could fall when they release their seat belts. And the reason I say that is from experience. Martha and I one time wound up on our side on a car. I released her seat belt, she fell on it. Believe me, it was painful. Their videos provided learning pilots access to the King's polished instruction in their living rooms. And the flashing red says, go away, don't land here, abandon the approach because the airport is unsafe for landing. Soon the Kings were teaching how to fly half the student pilots in the United States. You and I are about to do something that just a few years ago people could only dream of. With me as your instructor, you're about to fly. Over four decades later, the Kings say they have given up their search for a serious business. Their passion, though, for making aviation accessible to learning pilots at all levels around the world continues. What began in 1975 as this couple's love of teaching ground schools for pilots became King Schools Incorporated, the world's leading producer of aviation training multimedia programs. Martha and John have taught more pilots than any other instructor in aviation history. King Schools Incorporated embodies by far the most influential technology in aviation training. The goal of King Schools is to assist future pilots in obtaining all levels of pilot certification. Topics of their program include private pilot, commercial pilot, international operations, and many other areas of professional and leisure aviation. Today, via the magic of digital communications, the Kings deliver 10,000 video segments a day to learning pilots. Their video courses have had a profound impact on pilot training and in aiding pilots passing their FAA knowledge exams. The programs they have developed help pilots recognize the dangers of flying and equip them with the right tools to make important decisions in the air. The King's passion for flying has been manifested in various ways. In September of 1994, Martha and John became the first and only couple to both hold every category and class of FAA ratings on the pilot and instructor certificates. Martha is the only woman to achieve this complete rating sweep. The couple fly a personal business jet, a Falcon 10, as well as staying current in helicopters and single-engine airplanes. The Kings have received many awards and honors. Most notably, in 2003, Martha was recognized by the First Flight Centennial Commission as one of the 100 distinguished aviation heroes in the first century of flight. In 2012, Martha and John were jointly awarded the Frank G. Brewer Trophy for Aviation Education by the National Aeronautic Association for making aviation knowledge more accessible to pilots worldwide. Martha and John King remain involved in aviation and in their community to this day. The establishment of King Schools Incorporated has had monumental influence for pilots training in the United States and aviation education in general. The couple has certainly made their mark in helping current and future aviators reach their goals. The Kings consider their greatest honor in their flying careers to be the opportunity to help so many pilots reach their personal goals when it has meant so much to them. As pioneers in aviation education for all, we welcome Martha and John King into the National Aviation Hall of Fame.